Wish Upon the Stars 3, a superhero cultivation lit RPG by Malcolm Tent continues the adventurous blend of superhero fiction and lit RPG, literary role-playing game, elements with the concept of cultivation typically found in Eastern fantasy literature. In this third installment, the protagonist's journey intertwines their destiny with cosmic forces as they navigate the dual paths of gaining both superpowers and inner cultivation. The story resumes with our hero further along their path of both personal growth and prowess, having undergone numerous trials and tribulations that have honed their abilities and resolve. The protagonist, who has now accepted their role as both a cultivator and a superhero, is faced with the daunting challenge of balancing these aspects of their identity. Cultivation involves rigorous mental and spiritual discipline, allowing the practitioner to harness chi or life force to achieve supernatural abilities and ascend tiers of power. Meanwhile, their life as a superhero requires them to confront villains and protect the innocent, all the while navigating the complex social dynamics of a world that relies on heroes. At the outset of the novel, the protagonist returns to their base of operations, which serves as both a personal retreat for cultivation and a headquarters for their superhero activities. Here, they interact with a cast of supporting characters, including fellow superheroes, mentors in the art of cultivation, and allies who provide technical support. These relationships are tested and deepened as the story unfolds, with each character playing a role in the protagonist's development and in the unfolding narrative. The hero's journey introduces a series of increasingly formidable adversaries, both in the physical world and within the more esoteric realms accessed through cultivation. A significant antagonist emerges in the form of a supervillain who has also tapped into the secrets of cultivation, presenting a threat that is both physically dangerous and spiritually corrupting. This villain's goal is to harness a cosmic event known as the celestial alignment to increase their own powers exponentially, thus posing a potential cataclysmic risk to the world. In response, the protagonist must delve deeper into the cultivation arts, exploring ancient and arcane knowledge to match this new level of threat. They encounter diverse cultivation methods, each with unique philosophies and techniques. These methods often parallel the varied superhero abilities found in their world, ranging from brute strength to subtle mind control, encompassing elemental manipulation and esoteric energy attacks. Our hero is compelled to make choices about which skills to develop and how to apply them. As the hero embarks on this quest, they confront moral dilemmas that test their character. Their cultivation practice teaches them the importance of balance and the dangers of succumbing to power's corrupting influence. The narrative emphasizes themes of responsibility, with the hero grappling with the ramifications of their actions as well as their inaction. They are forced to weigh personal growth against the safety of others and to find harmony between their solitary cultivation and their public persona as a superhero. The lead RPG aspect of the narrative provides a framework for the protagonist's progression, representing cultivation and superpowers through a system of levels, stats, and skill trees. This system rewards the hero's achievements and setbacks with quantifiable changes to their abilities. These mechanics mirror the player's experience in a role-playing game, offering tangible markers of advancement and empowering the reader to track the protagonist's growth. Throughout the novel, the protagonist participates in epic battles that showcase their evolving capabilities. These confrontations are punctuated by detailed descriptions of martial arts techniques, the strategic use of superpowers, and the intricate manipulation of chi. The action scenes are crafted to captivate the reader, blending visceral combat with the cerebral aspects of cultivation. In the build-up to the climactic battle against the supervillain, the protagonist must rally their allies, forging new alliances and repairing strained ones. The story highlights the importance of teamwork and trust, demonstrating that even the mightiest heroes require support. The culmination of the hero's efforts is the confrontation with the supervillain during the celestial alignment. This event serves as both a literal and figurative nexus for the protagonist's dual journey. The battle is not only a test of physical might, but also of spiritual resilience, 
as the hero must resist the temptation to misuse the vast energies unleashed by the alignment. As the hero faces this ultimate challenge, they undergo a profound transformation. Their cultivation reaches a new zenith, allowing them to access a higher state of consciousness. This spiritual breakthrough is mirrored by a significant upgrade in their superhero persona, bestowing upon them powers that eclipse what they thought was possible. It is only through this ascension that they can thwart the supervillain scheme, achieving victory not through brute force alone, but through a superior understanding of the interconnectedness of all things. The novel concludes with the aftermath of the battle, as the protagonist reflects on the lessons learned and the costs incurred. While victorious, they are acutely aware that their actions have altered the balance of the world in unforeseeable ways. The protagonist's journey comes full circle, with a return to their dual life, now armed with a deeper wisdom and a renewed sense of purpose. Wish Upon the Stars 3 provides a thrilling blend of genres, offering readers a story of personal discovery set against a backdrop of superhuman conflict and mystical enlightenment. The protagonist's journey is a testament to the enduring appeal of the hero's path as they master the art of cultivation and rise to become the superhero they were meant to be, all while navigating the complexity of their own humanity. You can listen to the full audiobook for free by following the URL in the description.